I know it's a big problem in Brazil. I think it's true all over the world, but I know particularly in Brazil, a lot of people suffer from anxiety. What does it mean if you break it down? Anxiety means heightened fear. Fear of everything from making mistakes, wanting to be a perfectionist, mostly it's not wanting to be responsible, not wanting to be committed in life. You know, we avoid choices, we avoid commitment in life because we think we will lose the minute we choose something. And we don't realize that freedom without boundaries becomes swampy waters. You have to know to have freedom which has a direction, a commitment. Going from one relationship to another relationship, before one is really finished, before you've even understood, we jump into another one. What are we really doing? Avoiding the experience of a loss. We don't want to deal with it, so we fill the black hole by immediately latching onto another object, another person, another situation, outwardly go dancing, rah, 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 talking, sharing, without really feeling from the inside that you're free. And we do this a lot. Sexuality is another mechanism in which we fill a black hole. We finish a relationship with someone, we feel the loss, the grief of not having that person in our life. How long do we learn to sit with it? I mean, it's five days, maybe five weeks. But before we know it, we latch on to someone else. And then all we get into is sexuality. And the moment it's over, that encounter is over, you're left empty. And this only increases the anxiety. So few things have to happen. You have to learn to step back from decisions, agree to feel what is going on inside of you, learn to be with it. You have to do some meditation, some breathing, some time off to be with yourself, to see what is going on and to know that you were born alone, you can travel the journey's life alone by sharing what you have to give to others, not waiting to receive what someone can give to you, because nobody can fill your hole. Waiting for Mr. Right, you might get him, but that would mean you would have to become Miss Right. And that is a matter of learning to give, to share, to care, and pausing in between to evaluate a little bit of time with oneself.